Hello everyone and welcome to my channel. If you're brand new to my channel, stopping by for the first time, thank you so very much. I greatly appreciate it. My name's Elizabeth. My channel name is Shy Town Girl. I hope everyone is doing well. I am back from California. Well, I've been back for a week and what a whirlwind of a week it has been. I tell you, you get all crazy in your house before you go somewhere. And then it's all crazy when you get back, laundry and chores and grocery shopping. It's just crazy. But I am back. I am in the New York groove. My trip to California was <sighs> hectic, crazy, but overall it was wonderful. Not enough time um, out there, but it um, left me with some laughs, some giggles, um, some anxiety. Um, but those are things I'll share with you later on down the road. I need to do some catching up. I went to Dollar Tree for the very first time. I didn't even make it to a Dollar Tree in California because things were so crazy. One of the stores was closed that I had planned on going to. I was like, no, don't do this to me. Um, but I made it out yesterday for the very first time and I rounded the corner and I heard a squeak and it was Miss Joan. She was out doing some shopping. She came over, gave me a nice big hug, welcomed me back to New York. Uh, we had some chit chat and uh, then we continued to shop. So I also want to just mention quickly, um, my sister, I want to reach out to my sister Lynn in back home in Chicago. I was informed, uh, she rang me up and said, Hey, guess what? Now, mind you, my sister back home is just shy of 80 years old. Um, she's no spring chicken as my mom would say, but she had a bad fall carrying in some groceries and she fell backwards on some stairs and she ended up breaking four ribs punctured her lung. <sighs> I wish I was home closer. I'd be making you a hot cup of tea and we'd be sitting down together. I love you and I miss you so much. And oh my gosh. So she had a surgery. So Lynn, I love you so much. And I really, really hope that um, everyone's taking care of you back home. I love you and I miss you. Please feel better soon and I'll be calling you this evening. All right, everybody, I've got a brand new Dollar Tree haul to share with all of you. There's so much I missed out on. Um, a week away from the tree, and it's amazing what you miss out on. But I did find some good stuff. All right, so let's start off with some socks. Oh, my gosh, more socks. So it seems like the socks are making another round, but it also seems like they're, they're putting new socks in the mix. So basically every single item in this video, a buck and a coin, a dollar 25. When that price changes for you at any time, I will make sure that I point that out immediately. Every single item came from the same locations throughout the Hudson Valley, which is where I'm currently at. All right, some new socks. Let's start off with the original ramen noodles. Oh my goodness, can you believe it? I didn't see these the last time around, so I grabbed a pair of those. And then I found Frosted Flakes. And to be honest, I lost count of all the ones I had um, because I did donate them. So we're going to just start a new batch going here. And I've taken down my Easter tree. So that's why I'm kind of propped up over here right now because it's a mess in that corner. All right. How about Hey, 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 Kool-Aid. I love Kool-Aid to this day. I still drink Kool-Aid. It's good stuff. How about some Lay's Potato Chips? There we go. This would make a great basket. Again, <coughs> excuse me, we have Mother's Day. We have Father's Day. We have all kinds of things coming up. And one of my all-time favorites, who does not love Garfield and Odie. I have so much Garfield and Odie stuff from when I was a kid. I was a super duper huge fan of Garfield. I still am. I just don't have everything splattered everywhere like I used to. All right, so let's get away from socks. And go over to, have you seen some of the items in the Shore Living Department? My goodness. If you ever wanted to decorate a beach house or a house themed like a beach, Dollar Tree's the place to do it. They had all these amazing wooden signs. I just could not pass them up, so I grabbed them and put them away. This one says, this is our happy place. Relax, unwind make yourself at home that needs to be hanging somewhere on a deck or a patio by the water perfect the back side looks just like that so if you wanted to change it just flip it over and do what you want but i think that just says it all i love that saying 
Then I found two more to share with all of you. House rules. Get sandy, soak up the sun, relax, renew, and refresh. Now this one's kind of long, so I'll sit back a little bit. Isn't that just beautiful? I mean, come on. You cannot get that for a buck 25 in any kind of Hobby Lobby or Michaels. It's just adorable. Last but not least, I think this one's my favorite. Deck rules. Take a nap, feel the breeze, read a book, sip a drink, relax and unwind, listen to the birds, and look at the stars. This just, oh my gosh, I love this. I absolutely love it. I think they did such a great job. It's a pretty sign. It's just made out of that thin compressed wood, but they did a great job. I'm really pleased with those. Okay, let's go over to a few. Mm, it's food, it's summer snacks. It depends on how you look at it. This is definitely a bang for your buck and a coin. Large size General Mills Vanilla Spice Cheerios. Oh my gosh, it's the big in size. So this is 12 ounces. I've never even seen this flavor, but it's Vanilla Spice Cheerios. They are gluten-free. The expiration date on this is December 26th of 24. That's probably a reason why they have them. And you know, I was like just shopping along and I was like one for me, one for grandpa. And I was like, ah, oh. but you know what? A lot of times when I would get like extra cereals and if for some reason they didn't get eaten, what we would do is we would feed the birds. So you know what? I got one for me one for grandpa and the birds. So what I'll be doing is taking that out to the back side of the property for the deers and the birds and stuff. And um, it's still for grandpa, it's just for grandpa and the birds. All right, here's a great find. If you like to stock your shelves, if you have kids, if you're into, um, what do they call it? Like prepping your foods and stuff and, and different things like this. Wow, brand name, Progresso, and I love their soups. 20 minutes makes eight servings soup just add water or milk in an eight ounce package i've seen a couple videos since i've been home with other youtubers hauling this but i don't remember the flavors they found i found creamy corn chowder i did get two of them the expiration dates on these are august 29th of 2024 so that's probably a good reason why they're at the dollar tree but it's dry mix it's going to stay you know, it's a staple. It's going to stay on your shelf. It's going to stay in your cabinets. It's not going to go by. That's going to last you for a while. This was something I hadn't seen before. And Wise is a chip company out here. They make snacks and stuff. It's something for like out here in Chicago, just like Frito-Lay is as popular back home in Chicago. These are 3.5 ounces. And I've never even heard of these before. They're called Dipsy Doodles. What is a Dipsy Doodle? But you know, I was looking at it going, these look like Sun Chips, because I do eat Sun Chips. And Sun Chips, I'm not sure who owns that company. But anyways, I saw these, good size package, 3.5 ounce. I mean, this thing is packed and it's not air. The chips are right up to here. So I grabbed that, give them a try. This I thought was a cool find. I love my Jelly Bellies. I've been to the Jelly Belly factory in Wisconsin a couple of times. This is 4.7 ounces. Jelly Belly Belly Flops. They're basically jelly bellies that kind of are a little bit, you know, they got a little squish to them or they're oddly shaped. But to be honest, when I look through these packages, I really don't see many oddly shaped. What I'm seeing is probably flavors that aren't that often used and they do this, but that's just my opinion. Anyways, they're good till August of 2025. Again, it's a 4.7 ounce package. I scored four because I have a Jelly Belly jar that Linda gave me years ago. I have it on my desk and I fill it up all the time. And this is a very inexpensive way to get Jelly Bellies. So again, it doesn't say the flavors that are in here. It doesn't give me a flavor list. I mean, I guess if I read through it, I see strawberry, I see mango, I see kiwi. So it looks like some good flavors in there. All right, also in the candy department, where'd it go? I can't reach it because I got more stuff over there. So I'm going to skip that. I came across these and I had such a laugh. I want to say this was probably one time I was drinking one of my adult juice boxes and it was either Patty or Cheryl or both. 
They're instigators here on my channel, but in a good way. I love you guys both. Um, I was drinking one of my adult juice boxes and I was like, oh, you know, I need a big grown up juice box. Well, I'll be damned. I'll be damned. These are in the section where they have all their party stuff for summer. Look at what I found. First of all, I thought right away of Patty's daughter. Look at those. Mary, if you're looking, adult drink box juices with flamingos. Oh my gosh. So you're going to get six in a package. They come in several different designs. Here was the first design I found. You're also going to get straws. They had, and I'm going to open one of these up for you. They had this design that looks like that. Super cool. These are big. This I'm going to say is about two of my adult juice boxes, which is totally fine. Um, again, they're five by nine, so you can see the size that they are. They had another one, and this one says Sweet Sun. What does it say? I cannot barely read it. Bear with me here. What does it say? Sweet Sun. Oh, Sweet Summer. My bad. It's sweet, and then it's summer. And then they had this design, and I'm going to open up this design because I think this is too funny. So you're going to get six in a package. You're going to get six straws, different colors. They are bendy straws. They've got that bloop noise. I love that noise. You guys remember those hoops that you would spin around and they would go, woo, woo, woo. I know, I'm woo, woo, woo. Anyways, let's get back to these. All right, so here's what they look like. Oh my gosh, are these funny? <clears throat> All right, so I'm going to assume, are these the handles? Like to hold on to your juice pouch? Do, do, do. I'm just saying. Anyways, it appears. How the heck do you do these? All right, so here's where you open it up. There's a zippy thing in here. My whole hand fits in here. Okay, so they do pop open down like that, which is I was waiting to see. So they will independently stand. How cute. I'm assuming... You know, I'm not sure because what I do is I put a little slick like and then I put my straw in. I don't know. I'm going to give these a try. I'm going to assume these are handles. I could be wrong. If you put your straw in there and put it down, it might work. I don't know. I'm going to play with them a little bit. These would also be super fun as gift bags for a party. Why not? Put your ribbon through here. Fill up your treats. Since they independently stand from each other, you could set them at um, each placemat table. I don't know. I'm all about silly things like this when you're out having parties, having fun. So I grabbed a whole slew of them. That's me and how I roll. All right, let's go over to a few things I found in the beauty department. I have many things in the beauty department, but these few things are super cute. Perfect for Mother's Day. They're by Sassy and Chic. It's a compact mirror. They're really good size. They have, there's a great shot right there. The light's coming through the window where I had the tree, so there's a good shot. They're like a ribbon effect. It's very pretty. They're made out of like a heavy-duty plastic. Now, I'm not going to hit you bling-bling with the mirror, but you have a regular mirror, and then you have a mirror like if you're looking psh, little chinny hairs or whatever. I'm always checking them out. What a perfect place to do that in the car or in an airport where you got bright lights. Anyways, you got a mirror for both ones. Cute, compact to go in your purse or whatever. They had many colors. I just picked up two. I got one with this blue and this lavender I showed you. I want to say there was like pink, maybe like a greenish color. I don't remember 100% for sure. Okay, they also had in the beauty department, which I hadn't seen these before, I did find some of the Cher perfumes. These little bags are becoming so incredibly popular. But what this is... It, let me just rip one open. I got two. And it's the Sheer 70s Culture Eau de Parfum. Now, I had the bottles before, the spray bottles. Now, they have these Eau de Parfums. You like the way I do that? Eau de Parfum. Anyways, let's open it up here and check it out. Wow. So, it's an all glass. It's not plastic. There it is. Boink. Nice little spray. This one is nice, I will admit. You know, it's probably not 100% my thing, but, you know, my daughter liked it. So, yeah, all right. I saw it. I got it. So, pretty cool. If you like this scent, that would be something really pretty to put into something for Mother's Day. 
And speaking of Mother's Day, they have so many different little caps and shower caps and little containers that say mom or someone who, um, I think they have some in Spanish as well. So look in your stores. There's all kinds of special end caps for things for Mother's Day. Okay, let's go over. I have so many more things in the beauty. To, well, let's go over to these. These are really cute. I did get one in each color. My bad. I'm leaning away from my camera. I'm so unprofessional here. Well, I thought I had two colors. I'll show you this. I thought this was really cool. This is by Be Pure. Let me just fix it here. The color on this is just a color. I can't even describe the color. It's like a bluish teal, like in a robin egg blue. You get eight pieces. It is a cos. I was trying to straighten it out for you. It is a cosmetic brush set. Look at all the independent pieces that you get. You have a little zippy pouch here that you can get into all those pieces. So cute. Perfect if you're traveling and you can't, you know, you're limited on your space, but you need your brushes. It's got every single thing you could possibly think of. And how perfect size to go into a makeup bag container that may have to go in your purse. Super, super soft. Love the color. The fact that you get the whole set is just adorable. Again, it's by Be Pure. They had a couple colors. I had like a pinkish purple one because, oh, here it is. I had gotten one for somebody. Let me zip that up. And then here's the pinky one right there. Isn't that pretty? How cute. All just in that little zip pocket. Love it. Perfect for a basket or a container of some sort for somebody for Mother's Day. All right. I have so many more things I want to share with all of you. Um, but I needed to get my butt back in front of the camera and get my groove back on because, like, I am just off the charts. I have more things I want to share with all of you, so I am going to be back today. It's not a two for Tuesday. It's a Monday madness day for me because I have so many things I want to catch you up on. Um, I do have some happy mail that showed up as well I want to share with all of you. Um, some stories to share with all of you. Just all kinds of things going on. So, until next time, everyone, thank you so much for watching this Dollar Tree Quickie. Until next time, everyone. Bye for now.